Hi friends, today I wanted to show you my 2014 experience of taking part in the annual fundraiser of the Dublin Wicklow Mountain Rescue, a voluntary service. I was partly sponsored by the TCS Community Initiative. It was an amazing opportunity to hike in the Wicklow Mountains at night. It consisted of a 4-5 to five hours walk overnight on the longest day of the year, that is the summer solstice. The travel to Wicklow was really scenic and breathtaking. We reached Glenlock by 5 pm in the evening and started exploring the place. Here I was joined by Benny and a few friends who would help me complete the trek. There was a safety briefing before the unguided groups, the runners and the guided groups set off. Um, the idea of the guided groups is for anybody who maybe just wants to take a handy, not pay attention to the way they're going, and can just keep their eyes on the person in front who's wearing the orange vest. Okay? So you can see that all the participants are in yellow, that's for a reason, so we can see you. So if anybody wanders off, we'll know to go back in, get a leash on you and pull you back in. Except me, because I forgot to put mine on. We'll be wearing an orange uh, vest. It means then um, you'll quite clearly see if you are in any trouble or any difficulty or have any questions, you can go to those people and they'll guide you back to where you need to be or answer any of your questions. Being here today and taking time out to raise valuable money and also to raise awareness of mountain rescue in general. Um, as you can see, one of the vehicles parked behind you is one of the vehicles that were raised on one of the Walk the Line events. The money this year is to go towards obviously building on our current base where we're based is in uh, the Garda Station in Roundwood at the moment. So the money that we raise in this event is to try and just expand and develop that actual um, base that we have. Um, for us, last year was our busiest year to date. We responded to 110 call-outs, which is a huge amount. Back when we first formed, it was five or six a year. That built up to maybe 40 to 50 and last year was the biggest we've ever had. I wanted to complete this route unguided, so I set the GPS coordinates of this route in my view ranger app we had set out at about 9 30 pm but reached the first checkpoint only at midnight i was really tired <laughs> Uh, hello. Make sure you sign in just there, look. All right. Or yeah. else to be searching for you. All right. Yeah. How are you? We need to sign. How are you? Yeah. The second checkpoint dead tired at 3 a.m. I 
I was getting a little bit low on energy and a lot of puffing and panting followed. But then, the tea break. I was able to finally finish my walk at 5am, a good 7 and a half hours. Cheers to the Dublin and Wicklow Mountain Rescue Team for organizing this fundraiser and the good work that they do. All the very best to the team. So guys, please subscribe to my channel for many more adventures, treks and cycling videos right here. Somewhere, here. Cheers.